We are broadcasting live from what's left of Los Scandalous Shake and Bake Arena, one of the few structures to survive the big one. The fans are munching on tofu burgers, sipping Chardonnay, and getting ready for some mutant football. Today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams take the field. The Nuke London Hatriots take on the Los Scandalous Dam. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. If the sound of a torn Achilles followed by laughter and taunting brings a smile to your face, you are tuned to the right place. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow and the MFL crew is coming to you live on game day. Bricks, any uh, thoughts on today's game? Um, I thought I had one, but uh, I think I might have forgotten it. Oh, I remember. I forgot who's playing today. Careful what you ask for, Grim. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They had the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Oh, oh. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. harder than that and that is unfortunate now the offense is getting kills this is really a violent game guys third down and long Lineman swats the ball away with those meaty paws. God, it looks so snugly. Yeah, I guess if you're a monster. Now well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, do well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss this on here. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Oh, uh, this is a really violent Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And it's first and ten. First and ten. The defense called a sticky ball dirty trick, and the quarterback is in a shitload of trouble. <laughs> He's trying to throw the ball, Grim, but it keeps coming back. And the passing game picking up some steam, a gain of seven there. Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? And picks up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a, uh, <clears throat> hey, I got a dollar for the bathroom attendant. He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. If you don't think you can make the 
interception. Batting it down is the next best thing. Great advice, Grim. That receiver's going to go far in this league if he listens to you. I wasn't talking to... Yeah, never mind. Yes, Brick, he will. Well, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. Since when is that a penalty? Well, since now, I guess, Grim. And it looks like the and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And that punter gets paid way too much to kick like that. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. It's a mare in Lost Wages, Nevada. And it's first and ten. Oh, a great play by the defense. The receiver didn't stand a chance. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one. And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. And it's first and ten. Receiver on the play and knocks the ball loose. Second down and ten. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the MFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. First and ten. It's a pass and catch for a new game. And how is it a pass? Second down and ten. Pass and catch for three. The receiver needs to break some tackles. Third down and six. This is going to be a long kick. Let's see if he can make it. And it's good. You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good. Shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. They need a good return here to set up the offense. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for... You know what? Never mind. And it's first and ten. Went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. 
Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore grin. And it's first and ten. Great play by the defense results in an interception. And he breaks away. Oh, that was a hit. You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? I'll take the salad, Steve. Wait, where am I? First and ten. Second down and long. of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest tits? Wham! It's a time warp dirty trick. The last play is a race. How did they do that? Did they go 88 miles per hour? Just asking. whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your aunt. Uh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. First and ten. <laughs> Second down and more than the QB would like. It's anyone's game still at this point. I know, which makes it so hard to play some bat. Second down in a lot. Oh, man, what a throw. And Sonic and into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was on to the races. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no chip. Man, what a hit. That guy is not getting up. And it's first and ten. Come on! And the quarterback unleashes a sonic blast against the defense. Knock his cleats were caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they had raincoats in the front row, because that was splattering everywhere. One. 
second down and 10. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Third down and 10. for a couple of yards. And they'll line up for the punt here. And the punter has one job to do, and that's punt. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. And it's first and ten. Nice pickup for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. Cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. Second down, and we've got an offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down, and ain't gonna happen, partner. It looks like the defense hit the last. Not much there, maybe a yard. Third down, and never gonna happen. At this rate, the QB's gonna have more interceptions than completions. Oh, he just got crushed. First down and nine. And here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. It's first and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Second down and more than the QB would like. And he finds open space, he's running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. 
He's at the 40. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. And it's first and ten. Running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. And that would have been a disappointing run. It's even a worse throw. Third down and eight. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just... Oh, it was a punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. Two minutes left in the half. Second down in a lot. And the QB might as well just bury himself now because Bam! Bam! say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size. Because he just walked all over him. First and ten. <laughs> Nicely done for a first down. <laughs> and they take their first time out. Uh, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out there in halftime. And it's first and ten. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. He was starting to go somewhere, but he gets stumped after three. They usually stop me after three, too. You know, the all you can eat buffets? They're not as literal as you think.
And it's first and ten. And they stack the line and he gets his bell run for a yard. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. It's anyone's game as the third quarter begins. Both teams have taken their performance-enhancing drugs, and everyone is ready to rock and roll. The teams line up for the second-half kickoff. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. And he just wrestles away from that tackle. And it's first and ten. And he just slipped away like a greased pig. Second down in a very lot. And the quarterback calls a sonic blast dirty trick and then catch will give them a first down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. a pass that went nowhere. Oh, that's like me at the hotel bar every night. Hey, maybe you need a better opening line than you want to see the teeth growing out of the roof of my mouth? What? The book How to Pick Up Girls and Tell Them Something Unique About Yourself. That's unique. You're like a monkey trying to fuck That was a nice piece of running, Grim. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. for a second there. Second down and ten. He's not going down. The defense was there, but he still picked up a yard somehow. Third down and nine. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, yeah, still working on my salami here, Briggs. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah. Uh, uh. Didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. <laughs> oh, nice time warp dirty trick called by the D, and the offense is pissed. <laughs> oh, for you kids at home, that's how you play mutant football. Hey, wait a minute. What the? First down and one.
left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Third down and three. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about shit. Oh, mama! He just knocked him into the next time zone. And the ref is picking up a wad of singles as he runs off the field. How do you think he got those, Grim? Didn't you see him stripping on the sidelines? Yeah. He's bribed, you idiot. Third and two. The defense had enough with this ref and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> and that'll bring up third and one. Pick six, but dropped the interception. And that's why he's on defense, schmuck. A routine field goal, but as you know, nothing is routine in this league. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Yeah, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Kaboom! And the quarterback unleashes a sonic blast. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. And it's first and ten. Nice hit. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, look at this guy break tackles. He and he's off to the races. Touchdown! Why didn't the skeleton dance at the rock club, Grim? Yeah, I don't know. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned out the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chimp wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. Second down and long. force meets the explodable object. And he bursts into the end zone for the score. What a run. The offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. 
Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. And the MFL winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit, Grim. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. And it's first and ten. That pass was way off target, but I'm pretty sure the QB will blame the receiver as he always does. Second down and ten. Warming up. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self doubt, but he seems to have worked through it. And they line up for the extra point. It's good. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Boom, and he's dead. Turner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. Boom! Dead and down! He delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Yeah, I'm still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said! Ah! Didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. <laughs> he did not see that coming, partner. Yeah, not a ground crew's gonna come out and pick him up. This guy really kills the momentum. There should be a penalty for that. The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? First and ten. Second down in a lot. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't know. 
throw interception, but when I do, it's when the game is on the line. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger, because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message, because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. First and ten. One speed. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. First down and seven. And that player just transformed into a giant. Good luck, Buck. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. Are you proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Their marketing team hates it. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell was that? It's the same thing in the hurry-up offense, you moron. I am The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yep, the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick, and the QB is in a heap of trouble now. The offense changes the pace by going into a hurry-up. Does that mean the defense gets into a hurry-up, too? Grim, can I kill him? When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. He is fighting for every yard, and he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jets, you son of a bitch! And it's first and ten. Punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Oh, and that's how you play defense. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown, and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. The QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. And he's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. He's at the 40. No touchdown today. Looks like that defender ate his bleedies this morning. First and ten. Second down in a very lot. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is going to have more receptions than the offense. He broke free and has open field in front. 
one of them. In a hurry up offense, there is no huddle, so neither team can put their players on the bench. Man, I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. You just, you just. Good night, Irene. You ever get hit in the face with a shovel, Graham? I have. And trust me, the hit that guy just took was worse. And it's first and ten. And the defense gives up five yards there. Second down and five. It's three yards on that run. Third and two. And the two-minute warning sounds. There's not much time left at all. Third and two. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is football. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. He's going berserk. The ball carrier better watch out because it's all over the defender almost picked up the ball on that one. The quarterback shifts gears and goes into his hurry up offense. And he's running like a moose right now. Destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Ooh, that hit's gonna shave a few days off his life. And it's first and ten. The defense calls a timeout to stop the clock. They have two left. First and eight to go. Oh, with the brutal hit. At this point, they're going to have to get the ball back by any means necessary. Or wasting two timeouts on the defense is really going to bite them in the ass. their last time out. The defense can't bend or break. They've got to get a stop here. Third down and ten. This guy's a brick shit out. A nice run there for eight yards. And he takes a timeout here. They have two left. I wonder if he has a plan. Well, maybe he's just going to take the teeth out of the back of his neck that have been stuck there since the opening play. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. 
Here comes the kicker. Ma, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. I turned out the light, it wasn't. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? And he recovers the fumble and runs it back for a defensive score. That's a backbreaker for the offense. <laughs> the burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. And that's a returnable ball. Returnable? You mean he can get a refund for it? No, no, Bricks. It means he can return it for it. You know what? Never mind. And the Los Scandalous Dam win this one. After a stomping like that, the opposition may be a permanent part of the field. More like a graveyard, Grim. There are body parts everywhere. And speaking of body parts, did I ever tell well, you what I'm listen to the MVP. I'm sure he has something inspiring to say. <laughs> Grim Blitzrow with Brick Ed Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.